When people come into this building, it feels right. So there's a whole pile of things around this building which, get, which are both related to its historic past but also related to its present. The, the play space itself was intended to be an installation, an experience. We are hoping over time to create sensory zones, light zones, sound zones within the play space so that actually what kids get is not just play, not just exhaustion, but is actually something where they come out thinking differently, seeing the world slightly differently. And to start with, we decided to go big. So we imported a 60 meter dragon, right? Which was intended just to say, wow. Most kids, when they go into a play space, see the slide and go, wow. Here, they come into the space and they see a dragon and they go, ah, wow, or <gasps> And frequently they're terrified, which is okay. That's all part and parcel of what we do. What we've just done is to launch a share issue. Now the idea is to create a company which is owned by the community, which is a not-for-profit company, <clears throat> which is responsive to that community. And the idea of the share issue is to raise the capital needed to fund the initial development and, ma and management of this building. Now, without that capital, or without some capital, whether it's from donation, we don't care where it comes from, or from share issue, this building will fail. And that's because otherwise it is undercapitalized in terms of its ability to perform. The front end of the building is not yet, going, not yet what it's going to be, which is a full brasserie restaurant. And the object of that is to support all of the activities with quality food. Beyond that we have a gallery space which we're sitting in. And that gallery space is intended to operate both as gallery and a kind of recreational space where we advertise all the stuff that we're doing, where we can have people sitting and eating if necessary, and that happens too. And and then functions as a gallery in its own right. Beyond that we have a large performance studio which is both a dance studio, a drama studio, a party space, a multi-purpose space and then adjacent to that we have a workshop studio which is a making studio where you can make masks, where you can do artwork, where you can do a whole pile of visual arts creative work.